Welcome back. We are here looking at the foreign exchange market, and this is going to be my daily forecast for Thursday, March 25th, 2021. If you like to support our channel, you're welcome to hit the subscribe button down here in the corner, hit the like button and the bell button to see our new videos, and you're welcome to follow us over at Patreon. The link is down below. So we'll start by looking at the Great British Pound and the US dollar. And as you can see, we continue to go lower. We actually have breached the 100 moving average, and we haven't done that for a very, very long time. We have to go all the way back to November last year to see us test the 100 moving average or trade underneath the 100 moving average. So we did close underneath the 100, and that is a really, very very good sign. So if we open below 100 moving average and um, tomorrow we could see this drop all the way down to the 150 as at uh, at 134962 uh, so a massive drop to the downside technical indicators they are still very bearish however we are getting significantly overstretched here in the pulling japan so a pull back towards the 50 40 um, exponential moving average that is expecting at this point before going lower. So at this moment, MACD is bearish, uh, RSI is bearish, CCI is bearish, and also the stochastic is bearish. However, we're significantly outside of the bullish band here, and that is usually a sign that we will pull back before we go lower. So the US dollar continues to appreciate, and that is basically hammering uh, these um, currency pairs uh, at this current stage. So let's look at the US dollar and Japanese yen. So finally, we have seen uh, basically a interaction between the price level and the 20 exponential, and we have rallied a little bit. So we're up 0 0.19. We were up considerably more earlier in the training session, uh, but we pulled back uh, just a little bit. Technical indicators, they are, well, still very bearish, but they are turning around. So for example, stochastic is turning around here quite aggressively, but we're still far away from the signal line. MACD is still uh, bearish, the RSI is bearish, and the CCI is becoming uh, bullish, but uh, we're still in bearish territory. We are right here in the middle of the bullish band, and if we don't manage to break below the 20 exponential, then we could see this rally towards uh, 109 or 110. Break below the 20 exponential opens the door to the 40 and 107. So let's look at the euro US dollar and this also continues to go significantly lower. 300 moving average will most likely be our target at this point. 11.6957 is uh, at the, where the 300 moving average is at the current stage. We are at the bottom of the bullish band so I expect a minor pullback before going lower. Otherwise, other technical indicators are significant, are very, very bearish at this point. So we are in a downtrend. We have been trading lower and lower in this currency pair for the last few months. And it's just a continuation of the same thing. Rallies up towards the 20 exponential at roughly 11.94. They will most likely be sold into until we get to the 300 moving average, which we haven't... Uh, basically crosses since all the way back here in June last year. So we did reach the top here, 12.55, and since then we have been gradually going lower. Every rally has basically been sold into. So at this current stage, it is most likely the 300 moving average, which we will basically target. So Aussie dollar, US dollar, also here, we tried to rally a little bit and then we broke down. Technical indicators are looking very bearish for the Aussie dollar, US dollar, and uh, we are getting significantly outside of the bull in Japan here. So rallies up towards the 100 moving average, that will most likely be sold into. I don't expect any rally at this point. You can see that we tried to rally today and then we broke down even lower below the very lows yesterday. 150 moving average will most likely be our next target, 100 and no, 0 0.75. Uh, 21.3 is basically our next target. So US dollar, Canadian dollar, we have seen this rally up towards the 20 exponential and then break down and then give most of the most of those um, of the, for that fall we have gained again. So we're right at the, underneath that 40 exponential rally above that will lead us to the 50 and uh, the 50 has been significant 
resisted in the past and will most likely be sold into. We are trading above the um, middle of the Bollinger Band here, so a depreciation of the US dollar that may see this significantly um, uh, drop. And uh, technical indicators otherwise are fairly bullish at this current stage. So we'll probably see just more of the same rallies towards the 50 uh, moving average will mostly be sold into or even the 100 moving average. Target here will most likely be the very lows at 12, uh, 37, 16. So hope you find this helpful. You're welcome to support our channel by subscribing, hit the like button, the bell button to see our new videos, and you're welcome to join us over at Patreon. The link is down below. Good luck and thank you very much.